Hi friends, welcome back. Chido Onuma, a writer, activist, Igbo man, Biafra. He wrote a book titled, We Are All Biafrans. He was arrested yesterday by the agency called DSS, Secret Service Police. And the DSS claimed that they picked him up to save him from mob attack. This is fallacy because there weren't any mob. A lot of people don't even know who Chido Numa is. So why should there be mobs around to attack him? Where should there be anyone that want to kill him? The Department of State Service has denied ever arresting journalist and right activist Chido Numa, but rather it tried to save him from a possible mob attack. After more than 12 hours of silence since news of Chido Numa arrest broke, the DSS said that what it had with the activists was an interaction. Now, that tells you how criminal this DSS is. They said they are saving him from a mob attack. And now they said they are having an, they are having an interaction, which is simply interrogation. It was rather engaged in an interaction, that's what they say, during which an act like this could create public disorder and disunity in the country, was explained to him, said a spokesperson, Dr. Peter Afunaya, Onuma was picked up by DSS agents at the Namdiazikwe International Airport on his arrival from Spain on Sunday at about 5 p.m. He was released around 10.30 p.m. at the DSS headquarters after being quizzed, interrogated for being part of a plot to cause disaffection in the country, which simply means treasonable felony, just like the same that they are accusing Showare of. We are back to a full-blown dictatorial regime we are back to a military regime where every voice is shut down from what i'm saying if the Nigerians are not careful Shuari will be vying for the third term he will not want to leave he wants to die on that seat or probably will look for and i will sound like himself or another criminal that the Soviet court order to take over why should onuma be picked up and they claim that they are saving him from mob attack and they claim that they are quizzing him. The DSS gave a different version of the event. They said on his arrival at Namdi Azikwe International Airport, Abuja, on 29th September 2019, it was discovered that Onuma wore a t-shirt with We Are All Biafrans inscription on it, with credible intelligence that he might be a subject of mob attack if allowed to go into town in same clothes. The service invited him and drew his attention to the implications of his probable unintended action. It was strongly believed that an attack on Onuma would have sparked ethno-religious reprisals with dire consequences for law and order and public safety in the country. He understood the issues and pledged not to engage in activities that may cause disaffection in Abuja and in the country at large. He subsequently removed the cloth with the inciting symbols and inscriptions and agreed not to use it again. Is that word we are all Biafrans inciting? Anyway, maybe you have a different opinion to this. The interaction between Onuma and the service held in a convivial atmosphere, he appreciated the courtesies extended to him. Afterwards, the service arranged for him to be to be taken back to his accommodation in town. It is hoped that this clarification has dispelled the erroneous claims and reportage that he was arrested. The service acted within the confines of its mandate and only carried out its routine security duty that could have been discharged by a similar agency in any part of the world. It is not out of place for concerned security agencies to have sought clarification from a traveler concerning a subject of security interest. The DSS reaffirms its vowed, avowed commitment to the rule of law and protections, protection of citizens and national critical assets. This is what Afnaya said. Now, there are people that are in support of this administration. I don't know why. Maybe they are benefiting from the, this present administration. Or some might say, well, what can you say? You cannot fault them. They are actually fulfilling the their duty. If you are a DSS trained for that, you would actually 
respond the same way notwithstanding where you are from from nigeria you are not going to ethnicize this it's still an igbo man that is speaking this way having arrested chido onuma a biafran still a biafran what's your take about this let us be in the comment section below and while you're there may i remind you to kindly tap on that subscription button and also the red notification icon bell tap on it it's free so you'll be notified whenever new videos are uploaded thanks for stopping by